I have two propane cylinders. One is the onboard and one is the portable. Now I'm going to go over the portable one first. The portable one I use specifically just for heating and the reason why that it's portable is that way I can trade it in at any Walmart, Home Depot, or even gas stations if need be. If it's really cold, it usually lasts me about two weeks. Now as far as my onboard tank goes, I use that specifically for cooking and that lasts me over six months. Unless I use it for heating, which I rarely do, but I won't sleep with my Mr. Buddy heater on. And if it's really, really cold and my electric blanket isn't doing the trick, then I will cut on the um, onboard furnace. I really don't have a problem with that because I have my house batteries connected to four other batteries in my back battery bank. So yeah, I don't have to worry about it sucking down my power. So I can use that, but it, it, it can be a power hog. Now this portable tank has the gauge outside. As you can see, it's in the green, so it's full. And the gauge for the onboard tank is inside. Here it is right here, LP gas. I just hit that switch, and as you can see, it's full. Here's the onboard furnace, which I say I don't use. I rarely use that, and that's why my propane usually lasts me over six months on the onboard. This is my main heating source, the Mr. Buddy. Just cut it on high. Now this I'll use during the day or even at night, but I do not sleep with this thing on. I have taken a nap with it on and I do have a carbon monoxide detector along with a smoke detector. This is run to that 20 pound tank underneath this chair right here. Now this thing is awesome and it does the trick. It always keeps Panda really warm. This is the hose right here and it's run back and through this chair and down into the external cabinet that I showed you earlier. So that's my propane and it's pretty basic and simple so I hope that helps.